I realize that my humble abode isn't as fancy as the Baudelaire mansion, but I'm coming into a great deal of money soon, and I think it'll be quite charming when it's finished. Shall we take a look? This is the living room. The kitchen, I know what you're thinking. This place could use a little TLC. I trust you've had your tetanus shots. Polio, smallpox, typhoid, malaria. This is the entertainment for Rumpus Room. I've told the ceiling can be brought up to code in no time. You're not afraid of heights, are you? <laughs> Imagine that, a monkey afraid of heights. <laughs> My theater this way. What's that up there? <laughs> the tower, which you are never to enter. Under any circumstances. <laughs> This is where you'll sleep, time permitting. Nighty night. But the sun's still up. Jack Miller. I don't know if you've ever noticed this, but first impressions are often entirely wrong. For instance, Klaus, when Sonny was born, didn't like her at all. But by the time she was six weeks old, the two of them were thick as thieves. A phrase which here means fetching and biting for hours on end. In the case of Count Olaf, however, They were correct. Every morning, Count Olaf would order the Baudelaire's to do a great number of terrible chores, after which he would stalk off to his mysterious tower room. And as unfortunate as their situation seemed, it was only about to get worse. And I realized that these clever girls had stolen my kidney. No! <laughs> Imagine my surprise. <laughs> Orphans, this is my acting troupe. Acting troupe. Orphans. They don't look rich. <laughs> Ugly little people. Why aren't you children in the kitchen preparing our dinner? Dinner? It's the French word for the evening meal. On the back. Flip it. We'll take it in the dining room at 8 o'clock. And we'll expect absolute silence while we're rehearsing our play. But we've never made dinner before. It's already 7.30. 8 o'clock! <laughs> this puppy. Yeah. 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 Now, who shall play the most handsome count in all the world? Would you do it, sir? Oh, all right. Pasta puttanesca. That's Italian for very few ingredients, you know. That's great. Uh, Sunny? Will help. Okay, we're gonna need a pot. No pot. And strainer. No strainer. Thank you. Da -da. Uh, and a saucepan. This is a little piece I like to call electric chair. I think you might have to turn it up. Is anybody out there? Strainer. That's brilliant. Sonny, has that pot coming? <laughs> Sonny, that's not a pot. It's a spittoon. A spittoon? You mean like... Yeah. We'll wash it twice. Well... It's good. It's really good. Time check. 
Let's go back to prehistoric times when dinosaurs ruled the earth. Baudelaire orphans to the Gertrude Desk. Baudelaire orphans to the Gertrude Desk.